Hi friends, today I'm doing a full face of Glossier makeup and I've never used Glossier makeup before. Let's do it. Okay. Why does it keep coming out? <sighs> Is it worth the hype? So I'm gonna give you guys my honest review because I've never owned anything from them. I'm using this cute little heart mirror, are you kidding? I already put the Estee Lauder Double Wear Concealer over my face because I'm too insecure to foam completely without makeup because my acne is back, oh my gosh. <gasps> I'm going to go in with the Glossier Stretch Concealer in shade G11. We're gonna go over some of my more prominent little friends that are living on my freaking face. Okay, so, <laughs> so this is a concealer. From this angle, it looks empty. Guys, let me put my hair clips in. Don't even play with me. Are you kidding? Full flown beauty guru. I'm coming for everyone's spot. I'm first going to apply this with my finger. I'm gonna go in on this scar. And I'm gonna dab, dab, dab. Mm. Hello? She's covered. She's gone. Is this like a cute little close-up? I actually really enjoy this. My initial review of this concealer is a 10 out of 10. I only had to use my finger. I really like to use my finger when I'm applying makeup. Step two, I'm going to go in with the Glossier Boy Brow Grooming Pomade. Yeah, it's just clear transparent. I am just going to brush up my eyebrows a little bit with this Anastasia spoolie. There's no product on this at all. All right, perfect. Yay! I've heard amazing things about about the boy brow. So I'm very excited. Ooh, okay. I like this. It is indeed clear. It looks white, but it applies clear. Pause. This video is sponsored. And I made a music video. Three, two, one, go. I need some dossier. I need some dossier. Dossier perfume. Never lacking with my dossier perfume. Spray it all over you. Smelling bad at your gym class. But I got my dossier, perfume on uh, hygiene, dupes is on your scents, why sell in the trash, I'm saving all my cash, with dossier perfume affordable, cute packaging, aesthetic as bleed, showing everyone, my dossier perfume, it's linked down below, uh, click the link, you know you wanna. Perfume, spray it all over you. Smelling bad after gym class. Why sell in the trash? Yes, saving all my cash. Cute packaging, aesthetic as we. Showing everyone a dossier perfume. Mm. Click that link, baddie. Thank you so much, Dossier. Let's get back to Dossier. Let's like pregame in my lips a little bit. I'm gonna apply some Aquaphor to make sure my lips are hydrated. I'm also gonna put on some lip plumper right now. So by the time we do my lips, they're ready. Mwah. I'm gonna do my eyes next and then we'll do the blush. I did not get the Glossier Mascara because I'm obsessed with the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. When an eyelash falls, you get to grab it and make a wish and then blow it away. Hey, okay, mascara done. From Glossier, I got their Lidstar Glistening Eyeshadow in the color Lily. Ooh. Again, I'm gonna apply this with my finger. Sorry, not sorry. I can't close one of my eyes at a time. Like I can't, so I don't know how I'm gonna apply this. <laughs> Let me get close. Ooh, absolutely, y'all see that? Now I'm going to blend out. It's just so subtle and so beautiful. I'm gonna put on more because I want more. Glitter is just always the answer. I don't know how to do eyeshadow and so I'm really starting to think that the Glossier Lid Star Glistening Eye Glow is like the perfect thing for a beginner. She's subtle, she's sparkly, she is the moment. What the hell? Should I put on my inner corner? We're doing it. <laughs> Look at okay, I give the lid star an 11 out of 10. Iconic. Mm. Okay, we're gonna go in with the blush. I'm like so excited. I feel like a little kid on Christmas. This is the Glossier Cloud Paint Seamless Cheek Color in the shade Puff. Ready? You gotta peel this off. It's literally already coming out. I didn't even squeeze it. I feel like I kind of put blush where you're supposed to put highlight. I don't know. That might have been way too much. Rub it in. It's a cool feeling. It's super light, blending in really nicely. I'm gonna go in with this Morphing Setting Brush in AB. This is my blush brush. It keeps just coming out. I'm genuinely not squeezing it. That's a little weird. The circus is here. Oh my gosh, it literally just keeps coming out. I don't know what to do. Why is it doing that? 
that's really weird i literally can't put it back in so i'm just gonna have to like use it why does it keep coming out okay i'm just gonna screw the cap on like i don't know what is happening i feel like that's just my bottle i've never heard anyone talk about that happening it might just be like the air pressure or something my only critique for this blush it almost feels a little too watery i would have loved if it was a tiny bit thicker what i will say is i adore this color and i do adore the way it blended out but i will be using this every day <laughs> So take what I say with a grain of salt. It looks so natural and so glowy. Okay. Ooh, we got the Glossier Bombs, okay? I got GlossierBerryBomb.com. I got GlossierCherryBomb.com. And I got GlossierBirthdayBomb.com. I've already used the purple one. I'm sorry, I got excited. I already know that I really like the purple one. This is a beautiful color. And I never wear lipsticks or anything. I loved the idea of like a tinted chapstick. But I think that today, just for the sake of the video, I'll try the red one, why not? And then I'm gonna put the glitter on top. I'm wiping off the aquaphor just so we can like really just see how this product works. Okay, I'm gonna go in with a tiny smell. It smells so good. Okay, so it's definitely not as red as I thought, a little more pinkish, but I'm not complaining at all. I've been using the purple one for a couple days now, and what I will say is it's amazing how much product is in this tube for how little you want to use. I barely put any on, and this tube is huge. Like, this is gonna last. I really like this shade, but do I want to wear it today? Should we switch to the purple? I am gonna take it off and I also just want to show you guys the purple one because it's like my favorite. Oh, they smell so good. <laughs> I look like my wing sinks. Hey guys, Miranda. Welcome back to another video. Darling. The cutesy little ladybug. Now I'm gonna go in with the glitter. <sighs> Do you guys like see the glitter? Oh my gosh, I totally, I think you guys can. <laughs> There's like blue light right there. I should have unplugged it. It's a neon sign. Oh my gosh, it is sparkly and glittery and fun. <gasps> These bombs are a 10 out of 10. Oh my gosh. Let's take the hair clips out. All right, this is the finished Glossier look. My overall review is that I really love these products and I think that everything I showed is genuinely going to be a step of my everyday makeup routine. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out my Instagram. I know you won't. Oh, have a beautiful and blessed day. Bye guys, deuces. Mwah. Welcome my special guest, Shonda's Mad. Ah! Ah! Cow. <laughs> ah! I didn't mean to get aggressive. <laughs>